In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the fresh animations texture pack for the new version of Minecraft, which is 1.21.6. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come to this website right here. I will leave a link in the description down below. Once you are here, simply come to versions. Inside of here, we want to use the latest release just here. Now at the moment, it has got 1.21.5, but don't worry, this still works for Minecraft 1.21.6. Simply from here, come to the download button and select that, and that will download. We're also going to want the ETF as well so make sure you download this i will leave a link in the description down below to this come to versions and inside of here make sure you select the newest release and from here select on the download button we're also going to want the emf as well which is this one just here i will leave a link in the description down below to this simply from here come to versions and inside of here make sure you've got the latest release in here and click on download now we also need fabric as well so i will leave a link in the description down below to this from here select on download and click on download for windows and that will download also we're going to need the fabric api so we've come and download this as well select that from here come to files inside of here actually we've got the latest release in here click on the three little dots and click on download now while this downloading if you want to get yourself a minecraft server be sure to check out gtx gaming they have some really good high quality servers and they also come with a ddos protection so be sure to check them out at the link in the description down below now we are on the desktop from here what we're going to want to do is come to a fire explorer and come to your downloads folder Inside of here, we can now see we've got our mods and our fabric installer, also our fresh animations. Simply select all these and drag them to your desktop, just like that. Now, very important, make sure you do install Java. Now, if you don't have Java, I will leave a link in the description down below to a video I made on how to get that. That is very important and it's required for this to work. So make sure you do install Java. So the first step we're going to want to do is actually install the fabric installer. So double click on this file just here. This will load up a little menu like this one here on the screen. Simply from here, select on install and that will install, now done. Click on OK, click on the little X button and get rid of this file, don't need that one no more. Now what we're going to want to do is actually install these three files here. We're also going to want to install this file down here as well. So the first thing you're going to want to do is actually load up your Minecraft launcher. So once your Minecraft launcher loads up, the first thing you're going to want to do is come here to latest release. Inside of here, we want to select our fabric, which is this one just down here. Make sure it's the fabric loader 1.21.6, select that. Now if you can't find it in here, come to installations up the top here and inside of here make sure modded up there is selected. Now once you've found your fabric loader, come to the side here to the little file icon, select that. This will load up a Minecraft directory. Now inside of our Minecraft directory, we actually want to find the mods folder. Now if you can't find the mods folder, you can actually make a mods folder by coming to the side, right click, come to new and then click on folder, select that and just simply call this mods like that. And only do this if you have not got a mods folder. As I've got a mods folder, I'm going to delete that file. So my mods folder is right here. Double click into that file. And now what we're going to want to do is actually drag in the mods that we downloaded. So I'm going to move this over a little bit. I'm also going to move my Minecraft down. And down here we can see we've got the three jar files. So simply just drag these into this folder just here. Now also we are going to install the fresh animations texture pack here as well. So to do that, simply come back over to your mods folder. Click on the back button. And inside of here, we want to find our resource packs. Double click into there. And inside of here, if you have not installed a resource pack before, this will be empty. But if it does have files in here, it doesn't matter. Simply from here, just drag into this file like that. Close this window out. Come back over to Minecraft. And make sure you load up the fabric loader 1.21.6. Click on the play button, or you can come back over to play and click on play just here. Now you might get a little warning on the screen. If you do, just click on I understand and click on play. And now once you're inside of Minecraft, simply click on the escape key, come to options, come to resource packs, and inside of here we should have our fresh animations. Select on the little arrow there, make sure it's on the selected, then click on done. And now once you're back inside of Minecraft, as you can see, we now have the fresh animations mod working. As you can see, the villagers are moving and all their eyes move as well. We've also got the iron golem as well. As you can see, he moves differently from vanilla Minecraft. So that's how you install the fresh animations texture pack in Minecraft. 